CBI has just launched a new project with its member Exide Technologies and ICMA, the Materials Institute of Aragon. This project will look at neutron diffraction as a technique and how it can be used to understand the reactions that occur in a lead battery. This information is vital to further maximising the performance of lead batteries for both automotive and energy storage applications. SI has identified the main market driver for R&D activities. Based on this, the primary objective for the basic research department are to investigate and discover new materials and processes to allow life and cost improvement, while the specific performance uh, like uh, char acceptance, power, safety, high temperature endurance should be adjusted first to regular uh, standard and also, and most important, to customer requirements. Excite and CBI are about to start a new project. Up to now, microstructure studies have been based on teardown analysis. In this project, we will investigate if uh, neutron diffraction techniques are able to monitor, to monitor in situ the active material phase composition while cells are in operation. The main goal of the project with CBI and Excite is to analyze the different processes in the batteries by inoperando neutron scattering experiments. To this end, we plan to place real operating cell in a neutron instrument and to collect diffraction pattern and neutron images from inside the cell with both spatial and time resolutions. In this way, we will be, we will be able to monitor what is happening inside the battery in real operating conditions. This project will provide all CBI members with a new tool for obtaining information about what is happening inside the batteries in terms of phase composition when they are in operation. Hence, CBI members will be able to monitor how the active mass is evolving during the operation of the battery. As a consequence, from the information obtained, the efficiency of the charge-discharge cycle is expected to improve reducing the energy consumption during the formation and extending the life cycle.